So we shortened the box up so we can put inside the frame of the ladder here. Uh, it allows you to use the bracket here to build on. Uh, fits perfectly. It's still within the uh, framework of the trailer. Uh, in this particular setup, we're going to have a three-way ball valve so you can use the pump to pump in and fill the trailer and then pump out a uh, high-flow hydraulic motor. This is the first part of our setup, uh, is placement of the box where we're going to want it. Just a quick rundown. You know, once we get it where we want it, we'll take measurements and get the cradle built, get it bolted up, and then we'll move on to placement of the pump and reel and filter and piping. So this is a special milk thread. It's actually a milk trailer, uh, 6,200 gallons. Uh, we'll get a fitting here, and we'll 90 out, three inch piping all the way to the box. On this particular setup, the customer wanted to keep this manual valve instead of an air actuated or hydraulic actuated. Unscrew it, bam, it opens. In this application, the size of the filter and the flow rate, we had to go to a larger filter than we normally do. For that, we're actually going to build a cradle exterior of the box uh, to help when you change out the cartridges because they're 40 inches long. Uh, it's kind of tough to do that in such a small area. So we'll have flexible connections over there to separate it for vibration. We just don't sell components. Um, we do a lot of different things here at Calumet. Stay tuned as we progress along with this project.